after the partial lifting of the blockade, people think, you know, everything's more or less all right, the humanitarian situation is fine. In fact, it's not. I was shocked. We went to a school that is not a school made of proper materials. It's shipping containers. We went into a classroom of over 30 10-year-olds and they were sweating because it's hot in Gaza and it was very hot there. We sat with students, we met civil society business people and we had a wonderful meeting in the Palestinian Centre for Human Rights. And for everyone, uh, there's such a sense of being isolated. The young people, you know, are so frustrated and, um, you know, it, it really was very difficult. We have a lot of great minds here in Gaza who are seriously thinking of leaving Gaza and never coming back. Because, and who can blame them? Seriously. They are out of work, they can't proceed, pursue their education, they, they, they don't have a, a, a enough space for creativity. And, on, on, you know, they actually get punished for being creative. They're not being accepted. Okay, it's Ayman Amgames from PO, the Palestinian rappers rapping for the elders. Pain, I confess, I possess by the stress burning deeply in my chest. What's around me is a mess. No changes could be seen. My parish this is the mean. They kill him in the scene. Thank you. I have met with the uh, Prime Minister Hamia, and this time he had most of his cabinet with him. And in fairness, I must say, Mr. Hania did listen. And he actually said, uh, we are not perfect. If there are specific problems, uh, we will deal with them. And if there are mistakes, we will try to correct them. We are with you. We are with you in solidarity and real understanding. Uh, we have quite a sense of what life is like for you. And we have listened very carefully to the messages that you have given us. The elders have already called for the lifting of the blockade, but I call now on the international community. It is not acceptable that 1.5 million people are trapped in collective punishment. There is a need to understand the urgency of this.